Hey guys, welcome back. This is Saif with another tutorial from tech for all In this tutorial, I will show you guys how to show all three icons on the Windows 11 system tray. Let's start. Basically, when you install Windows 11, it does not show all of the icons on the system tray. You need to click on this icon and then drag and drop the application or the icon that you need to be pinned in the system tray. If you have multiple applications and lots of applications are installed in your computer, then dragging and dropping each and every application will be boring and very hard for you. Windows 11 have removed the option to show all the icons in the system tray. Let's see the taskbar settings in Windows 11 by right clicking on the taskbar and then go to taskbar settings. When you scroll down, in the taskbar corner overflow, here you can see that the applications which are installed in your computer, you can manually turn on the system tray icon. And if you install a new application, you have to come here in the taskbar settings and then turn it on, which is not a good practice. And also, who remembers the same action for each and every application that we install on our computer? To get rid of this setting, all you need to do is open run and then paste this command. I have put down the command down below in the video description. Copy it from there and then paste it in run and press OK. It will open the notification area icons setting which we used to have in Windows 7 and Windows 10. All you need to do is simply click on this option and then click on OK. And you will have all the icons in the system tray. Whenever you restart your operating system, all the icons will be automatically minimized and will not be shown in the notification area or system tray. To solve this issue, you need to download an application by the name of Show All Tray Icons, which is developed by a Reddit user. I have put down the download link down below in the video description. Download the application and then come back. Okay, now that you have downloaded the application, right click on the application, click on Show More Options and then extract the application after the application is extracted open the folder which contains the application click on the show.exe file copy the show.exe file and then paste it in your drive c users folder your user folder and then in the links folder you need to paste it in here. The second step is to right click on the show.registry file and then select on show more options, then click on edit. In this file, you need to edit or modify this specific text where it is written user. Delete the user and write down your computer's username. Mine is admin, as you can see, mine is admin, so I will write down the admin user and then save it. Now let's close the registry file, right click on it and then open it. In the user account control, click on yes. Here it says that this registry file will create a registry path and also a registry file. It's okay, click on yes button. The key and values content in this folder is created or added to the registry, okay? Now all you need to do is restart your operating system and then we will check that whether the system tray icons will be going back to their default locations or they will be hidden or not. Let's restart the operating system. Here, as you can see guys, that I have restarted the operating system and after the restart, the system tray icons are still in the place and they are not hidden. And that's all for today guys. Thumbs up if you like the video and subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to stay tuned with the future upcoming videos. I will catch you very soon with another tutorial. Till then, have a nice time.